During your solstice moment, solar eclipse ring of fire, throughout the 20th, 21st and 22nd of June 2020, there will be a continuous call put out to fifth dimensional and higher harmonic fourth dimensional individuals across your globe and throughout space and time. For the psychic battle and spiritual war begins for the final showdown in respect to the control of consciousness and timeline creation. Whilst the light has already won, if you will, you are called to draw this pre-matter blueprint into your physical reality and create that which has been created. Pre-matter remains pre-matter until it is drawn down by the holders of magic in physical incarnation. This, through focused negative intention, can be inverted into an illusory, false and opposing presentation when service to self magic is performed. And this is the plan and plot for your solstice, solar eclipse, three days of the new dawn, new earth seeding of the 20th, 21st and 22nd of June, 2020. The call is for all those with Christed Christ connections across the board to join in telepathic union to deliver the counteracting force and thus the antidote to the negative inverted intention magic. Christians, Buddhists, pagans alike, all religions and those who follow no religion but stand for truth, harmony, sovereignty and honour, you are called to action on these days. Hold joy in your hearts. We realize this is most challenging at this time in your current Nexus moment, yet you have the tools to do so when you are reactionary to inner realities. And that takes precedence over your reactions to the outer reality until the outer harmony templates root themselves upon your planet. So hold joy togetherness, unity, and in your minds you hold one another. You draw one another close through unconditional love for your fellow man and woman, and you rejoice. For they, the service to self factions, would separate you through fear and terror. And your antidote is unity within love and safety. For your cheers of success, your relief at your freedom and liberation, and your unconditional love of one another, is that which creates this within the physical. Therefore we say love and act as if the reality you seek has already happened. We repeat, love and act as if the reality you seek has already happened. Wake with joy each morning for the richness, healing and abundance that the new earth offers. Even whilst this may not have actually occurred within your physical reality yet, from your point of view, you live as though it has. You exist holding the emotions as though it has already happened. For this is global and collective manifestation through the power of the law of magnetic attraction. During these three days we speak of, this is the consciousness template you are being called to hold. These are unity templates with tangible seeds of alchemical unification within. This is true and tangible alchemy on earth. The unity templates hold the harmony templates within as holographic containers. For it is unity and harmony that shall be the building blocks of the new earth and you Dear starseeds, you are the builders. 
to all awake and enlightened individuals and all those who stand for truth you are thus called the 20th the 21st and the 22nd of June 2020 your solstice point solar eclipse ring of fire new earth creations we are the white-winged collective consciousness of nine what is karma are there ways we can balance this and become karma free is there a particular nutritional plan we should follow for ascension do we increase our karmic balance by eating certain foods? How can we utilize sex magic to work with karma and move through ascension? There are many lessons we can learn from the peoples of ancient Lemuria, a civilization that existed before our known history on planet Earth. As we move through an ascension process collectively, we move back into a new Lemuria and we take with us all the knowledge we have accumulated since those times. In this transmission from the white-winged collective consciousness of nine, key codes are presented for cellular memory recall, linking the reader beyond Atlantis and into the harmonious frequencies of the first physical civilization on the Earth, Lemuria. The nine respond to questions using the Lemurian way as a template. Key coded responses trigger activations within the reader as they receive the wisdom codes, standing as rainbow warriors of Gaia, moving into abundance, alchemy and stargate ascension. This transmission is dear to my heart and I'm so very pleased to announce my new book Lessons from a Living Lemuria.